I'm here with a couple of my best, furriest friends down outside the Lapine Community Center. This is the first stop of this week's Rip City Rally. I spoke to many people who came from around Central Oregon. Everyone's having a great time. Take a listen. We don't get this a lot around here, and it's really <laughs> cool to see it come. Uh, I love how they're like, they encourage and include every small town there is. The Rip City Rally kicking off in Central Oregon. It's amazing like to have this kind of uh, atmosphere for the kids like and they've been coming home from school today excited about getting to meet all the mascots and everybody at school. Their community fair includes games, merch, and even some hardware from yesteryear. Lapine is the first and only Central Oregon location in this year's rally. It's an event the Trailblazers use to cement their identity as Oregon's team. The Rip City Rally is an opportunity for those of us with the Trailblazers to come out and serve communities that don't have the opportunity to get to Portland. There are some folks around here and on our trip that have never been to Portland, have never been to a Trailblazers game. So it's our opportunity to bring the Trailblazers to them. The fair finishes the Blazers Day, which started at Lapine Elementary Monday morning with a school assembly and PE activities to get the students moving. We make sure the message is, is heard that we know that you're here, we know you're Blazers fans and we're thinking of you. So we, we love coming to parts of the state that we've never been to before. From here, the Blazers will continue south. They've got a date in Lakeview tomorrow, then round out the week with Klamath Falls, Medford and Cottage Grove. From Lapine, Peyton Thomas, Central Oregon Daily News. Thanks for watching. If you liked this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and ring the notification bell so you don't miss out on more videos from Central Oregon Daily News. And for more news from the high desert, just visit centraloregondaily.com.